Well, hello there. Uh, hopefully this one will be a little shorter, um, but uh, cloud architecture and design, it's 13% on the Cloud Plus CompTIA exam. Uh, we're on in 1.4, uh, given a scenario, analyze the solutions design in support of the business requirements. So, uh, you know, pay attention given a scenario. So they'll probably give you scenarios on the test. Okay, uh, so requirements analysis, uh, what software is needed, okay? Uh, what hardware is needed? CPUs, memory, storage capacity, uh, integration. How? What are the touch points? How does it interact with other systems? Uh, budgetary. Can we afford it? Uh, cloud is operational, but in-house might may be cheaper in the short term due to prior capital expenses. Remember, capital expenses are things like we bought this data center, we have this building. Uh, we bought the servers, so all we're doing is spinning up another thing on there. So all we're paying for is the electricity because all the stuff is already a capital expense. Um, uh, compliance. Uh, uh, so are there things that we need to worry about, such as can data be stored in this or a country, or is there country rules that require us to store it elsewhere? Um, service level agreements what to expect from who, how fast, and, and during what times. Um, so user and business needs. Uh, does it actually do what needs to be done? Uh, does it meet what the business is asking for? Uh, and security, are you comfortable with uh, how it's meeting those needs? Uh, th this is interesting because we, I hear a lot of people talking about the security of the cloud, it's not that good. And most of those companies have horrible security standards right now um, and going to the cloud they're going to stay horrible um, the biggest thing it, with cloud is uh, a lot more people are using it so hackers have a better understanding of how it works but usually there's some things that are going to be more secure uh, moving them to the cloud it, but if you're already not very, not good at what you're doing uh, it, you're going to stay not good uh, so security needs to become a priority for many businesses. And then, of course, the network requirements, the sizing, how big, uh, fitting it in the subnets, routing, uh, how to navigate to the functionality. Okay, so environments. And, and I like to think of this, this was is from um, a friend of mine that uh, gave me some information at once when I was uh, starting. Sorry, I'm going to silence something. Um, Uh, when I was starting in in uh, systems and stuff. And they talked about how uh, if you think about things as to if it's current or if it's the future or or even minus, we actually had a minus one as well. Um, so development, this is hopefully going to eventually be quality secure uh, staged and then become prod, right? This is where developers are playing, uh, trying to learn, trying to do things. Uh, from a programming or a setting up type of thing. A quality assurance is where they're te they're making sure that the, the what's been changed uh, meets the, the, the standards and needs. Staging is where you, you kind of user acceptance testing occurs, make sure everything works well together. Uh, we haven't done something that's going to break something else that we didn't pay attention to. Uh, blue green. This is interesting because you can have current and the future version at the same time. And you can even send traffic to both if you if you like, so you can see if there's errors and stuff. Um, in that case, the anything going to the green would have to also be updating the production database if there's a common thing behind the scene. Uh, production, what most people currently see, it's a current. And disaster recovery, which should be current. And hopefully we never need disaster recovery, but we need to test it because if we do need it, We'll be really sad if we don't have it. Um, and then testing techniques. So vulnerability testing. Um, is there an issue with our systems that is that we know about? Uh, penetration is when you have someone testing for vulnerabilities um, and, and actually trying to get in. Uh, performance testing is trying to see if um, our, our system can meet the the people coming at the speed that they come, um, and is it is it going to continue to reliably give people the experience that we would expect it to give? Um, regression testing. 
do we have, um, is it going to break something else? Uh, something that's already there, moving this new thing forward. Is it compatible? Uh, uh, functional testing. So does it do what we said it would do? Uh, and usability testing, even though it does it, does it do it in a way that is usable? Um, so because sometimes we do things in, in a really weird way. And if we just changed it slightly, it'd be so much better. So um, does, it, does it meet the, the usability needs? So anyway, I, I hope you've enjoyed this. We are now done with uh, the first uh, section here. So we did cloud architecture design. That was number four we just did. So we're going to start on security next time. Happy day. Have a good one.